Hi, welcome back to the channel. Need to edit a PDF file on your laptop but don't have Microsoft Word? No problem. In this video I'll show you a fast, free and easy way to edit any PDF using just your web browser and a Google account, no extra software needed. First, open your browser and head over to Google. Com. If you're not already signed in, click the sign in button in the top right corner. Enter your email and password to log in. And if you don't have a Google account yet, you can create one in just a few steps. It's completely free. Once signed in, click on the Google Apps icon in the top right corner of the page. That's the little square made of dots. From the list, choose Google Drive. Inside Google Drive, go to the top left corner and click the New button. From the drop-down menu, select File Upload. A window will pop up. Now just locate the PDF file you want to edit, select it, and click Open. You'll see the File Upload progress at the bottom right corner of your screen. Once the upload is complete, your PDF will appear in your drive. Just double-click the file to open it. Atop of the preview, you'll notice a button that says Open with Google Docs. Click on it. Google Docs will automatically convert your PDF into an editable document. After a few seconds, your file will open up in Google Docs, and now you can start editing. Add or delete text, move images, fix formatting, it works just like editing any regular document. When you're done making changes, you can save your work back into PDF format. Just go to File, then hover over Download and select PDF Document. Your edited PDF will download directly to your laptop. You can find it in your Downloads folder or wherever your browser usually saves files. And just like that, you've successfully edited a PDF on your laptop without using Word. This method is quick, free, and works perfectly for most PDF files. Try it out the next time you need to make edits. No installations, no subscriptions. Thanks for watching. If this helped you out, don't forget to like the video, subscribe for more useful contents, and press the notification button as well. Drop your questions in the comments below as well. See you in the next one!